Hello everybody, in this video we're going to learn about list methods, and that information is going to help us add to lists, remove from lists, and much much more. Alright, let's get going. So here's a scenario that might come up in your Python programming. I have a list of my favorite fruits, and maybe I want to add a fruit. Maybe a cherry is now one of my favorite fruits. And then I decide, well, maybe orange is not one of my favorite fruits. And maybe for some reason, I want to alphabetize my list of favorite fruits. Well, all of these things can be done with something called list methods. You might be asking yourself, Dr. Wu, what's a list method? And a list method is just a function that works on a list. You'll see a lot more about methods when we do objects later on, but that's the terminology. Students in the past have not really had a problem using list methods, but the terminology confuses them sometimes at the beginning. Just have faith, they've gotten it, and you will too. So here's the syntax or the formula. We start with the list, the dot, and the method. And the method is what's happening to the list. Then we have the parentheses and then arguments if they exist. So this is going to be a little bit easier to see once we look at it in action. I'm going to make a list of numbers. Then I'll print them out. The first list method we're going to look at is append. Append is a word that means add to the end. It shows up all over in computer science in case you know another language. And we'll use it now. So the formula is list. So that's numbers. Numbers is my list. Dot. And then the method, which is append. And then arguments. And in this particular one, the argument is what I want to add. So let's say I want to add the number 12. I'll run it like that. Then I'll print it out afterward. And let's see what we have. And as you can see, we've added the number 12 to our original list. Uh, so you might ask now, what's a scenario where I might use an append? And let me show you that. So if I say new numbers, I'm going to make it a blank list. And what I'm going to do is look for all the even numbers and put them into new numbers. So to do this, I'll loop over the list. And I'm going to check for even numbers. So if number mod 2 is equal to 0, this is even numbers new numbers that append and I'm going to add the number that I'm on now. So at the end I should have a list of even numbers from the old list and I'll try it now and here it is the, only the even numbers. This is a super super common thing in Python you have a for loop here inside that for loop you're checking each item for some condition and then you save the ones you want to a new list. All the time you'll do this. All right, going back to my original scenario, I talked about adding items to the list, and I talked about removing items from the list, and I talked about sorting the list. So how do you do that? And the general answer is, you don't know. You have to Google it. You have to sort of be inspired one day, say, hey, this is something I want to do. I don't know how to do it. I'm going to Google it. So let's try that right now. Uh, so let's see. List method remove item from list Python. Let's take a look. Uh, and let's try this first one here. So here it is. Sum list dot remove and then the parentheses. So this is my list dot and this is my method. So it looks like it's remove. Let's try it out. So my list is numbers and the dot. And then I need the method, which is remove. And let's get rid of those three. And let's print it out afterwards to see if it's actually worked. And so you see this one before had the three. And after I did the remove method, there is no three. So this works. If I want to remove something, I'll use the remove method. You might ask the question, how do I know these even exist? Well, if you work in other programming languages, they tend to be kind of the same thing across languages. But maybe one day, you just happen to Google it. So list method Python. And let's try it out. Let's look at this first example. And so maybe one day, you look at this documentation just to get an idea of what's out there in case you need to use it in the future. You click on the link, here it gives you some examples, you can try it out. And that's pretty much how people learn new things, by using Google and just reading the examples and trying it out. Finally, I talked about sorting these in order. Let's just take a look. Do I see something here that has a sort? Ah, looks like it is, there's a sort. So let's just try it out. And there you go, the numbers are sorted. So that's pretty much how it works. You have a question, you Google to see if there's an answer, you find the answer and you try it out. All right, so here are the solutions to the labs. Pause the video and try it out, but if you can't get it, here are the solutions. So the first one I'm going to try is list methods one. I have a list of friends. I want to add my friend Joe to this list. And then I want to print out the list afterwards. So let's try that again. How do you add to a list? It's append, list.append. So list is friends.append. 
and then the parentheses, and then inside the parentheses is who I want to add. So Joe. And then it wants me to print this out. So let's try that out. And it's good. Next one. List methods two. It wants me to remove EOB from my list of friends and then print out list of friends. So remove. How do I remove? I don't remember, but I can Google it. And if I do, I'll know it's remove. So it's list.method. So list is friends. Dot method is remove. The parentheses. And then inside the parentheses goes who I want to remove. So it's going to be EOB. Let's try that out. Oops, I forgot to print it out. I should print it out just to double check that it really did work. And when I see EOB's not in here, I know it works. All right, so that's pretty much it. Hope that was useful to you. And if it was, please give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.